So in this presentation we're going to so show that uh, cosh squared x minus shine squared x is equal to 1. These are hyperbolic uh, functions. Uh, cosh of x is equal to a e to the x plus e to the minus x over 2. Just for the sake of simplicity what I'm going to do is actually just rephrase that a little bit. I'm going to put them over 2 separately. Shine x is e to the minus x minus e to the minus minus e to the minus x over 2 and again I'm going to slightly rephrase that I'm going to put them both over 2 separately they're both for, uh, terms are equivalent to each other but it just for our purposes it makes life easier I just like you to remark upon the fact that it's just one term plus the other term and essentially what we have to do is square them so cosh squared of x is equal to e to the plus x um, plus e to the minus x over 2. Uh, e, to the e to the plus x over 2 plus e to the minus x over 2. So this is just in the form a plus b squared which is equal to a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Okay. Here a squared a is equal to e to the power of x over 2 so that is equal the square of that is e to the 2x over 4 uh, similarly b squared would be e to the minus 2x over 4 2 times 8 8 times b so this is 2 times e to the x over 2 uh, times e to the minus x over 2 now e to the x times e to the minus x they cancel out to give you 1. So we have 2 times 1 over uh, 2 times 2. So that is equal to 1 half. So let's just write it out again. This is equal to e to the 2x over 4 plus uh, because we're just, I'm just sort of keep the denominator as 4 so I'll leave it as 2 over 4. Although it's clearly a half. Okay. Now, the next one is um, shine. So I just actually have to rephrase a bit of that. So it's very similar to shine squared of x. And that is e to the plus x over 2 minus e to the minus x over 2. And again, this is in the form a minus b squared is equal to a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. This is very similar to what we've done the last time actually. Um, almost identical actually. The only thing we're doing, we actually we can get to use this answer completely again. Okay, the only thing that is different now is the minus 2 over 4 in the middle. So it's just using the same answer again. So it, this is e to the 2x over 4 minus 2 over 4 plus e to the minus 2x over 4. Okay. So, cosh squared x minus shine squared x is equal to e to the 2x over 4. Oops, should we, that should be x. Over 4 uh, plus a half no, no, keep it as two, 2 over 4, plus e to the minus 2x over 4, minus e to the 2x, now we're in minus shine now, over 4, plus 2 over 4. Essentially all we're doing here is changing the signs here. So that's going to be minus, that's going to be plus, and this one's going to be minus as well. Uh, minus e to the minus 2x over 4. You'll see things start to cancel out. E, the first term here, cancels out with this. Both go to 0. The third term here cancels out with this. This because it's a plus and a minus. They go to 0. So what are we left with? We are left with plus 2 over 4, plus 2 over 4, and that is equal to 1. So we've proved what we're looking to prove that cosh squared x minus shine squared x is equal to 1. And we'll leave it there.